Hi guys and girls on YouTube and welcome to my channel. The video I'm putting out this week is going to be a really quick one because I'm in the middle of a big job. Uh, I'm assembling some circuit boards for a customer and he wants uh, 200 of them making. So it's going to be a really quick video of this. Um, as you can see I've got all these boards and I've got to populate them. So right, let's move on to the video then. Right, so everybody will recognise this. It's the Peak Atlas DCA55 transistor analyzer. Now, I don't know if you're aware, but there was a model before this, and I've looked on YouTube and I can't find any references to it. So let's have a look at the model before, dating from 1997. So here we are, still in its box. It's the Peak Atlas DCA50. Um, now, I don't know if you know, but... This is quite an early transistor test. There is one before this, and uh, Jeremy's going to kill me for doing this video. Uh, but let me show you um, what how this became about. Now, just in case anybody's interested, I actually did a review on the DCA50 in the March 1998 um, issue of Television Magazine. And uh, you can also get this on the World Radio History. Uh, so if I just turn over, um, that's it there. If anybody wants to uh, check it out. Right, now I bet you've never seen one of these before. This was the start of the Peak Atlas transistor tester. And uh, as you can see, we've got a row of LEDs and the bottom row is all lit up. Um, so what you do is you clip your transistor on. Right, I've just turned off the light actually so we can see a bit better. So you can see the bottom row of one, two, three, four, five, six LEDs are all lit up green. Right, let's just uh, clip a transistor onto here and see what happens. Right, so as you can see the transistor's now clipped on. Uh, now we've got um, different LEDs lit. We've got um, a funny pattern of lights. So here we look up the pattern of lights on the tester and it tells us we've got an MPN transistor. So here if you want to read about the very first peak transistor tester uh, let me show you where it's published in a magazine and you can look it up yourself on the internet if you go to World Radio and uh, you look up this magazine on World Radio it's Practical Electronics August 1996 and there it appears on the front I'll just stop the camera while we turn the page so there we go that's a constructional project uh, the author is Jeremy Francis Siddons if we look down here young engineer for Britain prize winner and um, I'll just give a quick scan over this, uh, but you can, of course, um, if you want to read all about this, um, you go to World Radio History on the Internet, and because um, there's quite a few pages here, and you can read it all for yourself. Right, oh, okay, guys and girls, I told you this was a quick video. Um, I'll probably uh, have a bit more time to make a bigger video next week. Right, okay guys and girls, many thanks for watching and uh, I'll catch you next week hopefully in a bigger video. Goodbye.